Hey YouTube, Derek. Uh, in this video, guys, I'm going to be just bringing a Jesuit Roman chivalry order to your attention that you may not have known of. It's they, This order, guys, flies really under the radar. It's called the Royal Order of the Seraphim, uh, based in Sweden. Uh, King Gustav of Sweden is the current sovereign. But I'm going to show you guys this order. Guys, it has tons of Roman Jesuit symbolism, okay, guys? And there's just so many prominent... Uh, world quote-unquote world leaders who are part of this roman jesuit chivalry order okay guys so you see the conflict of interest i'm going to prove it to you guys without a shadow of a doubt three orders control the world watch my video guys on the jesuit uh order of isabella the catholic okay also guys i expose that chivalry order in detail but this is the order here guys the royal order of the seraphim and guys just look at the logo you guys right there on the logo guys ihs okay guys for the society of jesus Okay, and you see the three papal Sescalev trusts right here. Okay, guys, realizing Rome's positive law, uh, ownership of this matrix. Okay, guys, the Earth. Okay, guys, the Earth is under Roman maritime admiralty law. You see here, guys, it's on the logo. IHS. Okay, I'm actually I'm gonna play a video here, guys, under um, fair use. I just want to play it. So I'm gonna show you here. Um, I'm gonna show you a little clip, clip, guys, under the fair use act. I'm not monetizing this. But here's here, guys. Here's a picture of, or here's a quick video, guys, of a uh, of, of a case. Um, here, you guys, see order the order of the seraphim, Sweden, July 1948. Okay, look at that. There's the medal right there, guys. You see IHS right there. Okay, with the Roman Maltese cross behind it. I didn't add that in earlier as well. But you see, you guys, the Roman Maltese cross is the symbol of Rome's control. Right there, guys, the Order of the Seraphim, IHS, right on the logo. <laughs> okay, and this order, guys, was created by um, King Frederick I, okay, which was this guy here. He was a Catholic king of Sweden, okay, guys. Um, so you guys, king of Sweden in the 1700s, okay, guys. And also the other chivalry orders, guys, in Sweden are the Order of the Sword and the Order of the Polar Star. Okay, guys, and you see on all the order of the polar star has the Roman Maltese cross too with the papal crown. Okay, and um, so yeah, so just continue, guys. I link this in the description, so check that out. Okay, but guys, look at all the current members of the with the Jesuit logo on it. Actually, and just to show you guys the current, you see here, guys, all the sovereign guys is King Carl of Sweden. Okay, guys, I, in my video of uh, Queen Elizabeth, guys, I showed you Queen Elizabeth is the sovereign of chivalry orders but he king carl gustav of sweden is the sovereign order of the seraphim so king carl guys is taking orders from the jesuits okay he's the highest ranking member of this roman chivalry order okay but the guys the current members basically guys the whole swedish royal family so you got king carl gustav here guys king of sweden since 1973 you got princess margarita of sweden okay princess briga sweden's in this order desiree princess of sweden christina princess of sweden um, Sylvia, Queen of Sweden, um, Victoria, Princess of Sweden, <laughs> Carl, got Prince, uh, Prince Carl in Sweden, Princess uh, Madeline okay, in Sweden, Prince Daniel. You see, guys, they're these young Swedes, like Estelle, guys, was born in um, born February 2012, so she's only seven years old, and she's already in this uh, Swedish order. <laughs> okay, can't make this shit up. Um, they're probably like uh, watch my video guys on the Belgian, the young Belgian royalty. I haven't done an investigation on the Swedes, the Swedish royalty, but the Belgian royalty are educating their kids at Jesuit schools. You see here, guys, um, another princess of Sweden, Leonor, born in 2014, is already part of the chivalry order. So Princess Sophia, uh, Prince Nicholas, born in 2015, is a member of this order, and Prince Oscar, born in 2016, part of this order. Prince Alexander, born in 2016, already part of this uh, Royal Order of the Seraphim. Oh, born in 2017, is already part of this Royal Order. He was born December 30... Yeah, no, born um, August 31st. Wow, so the kid's only like six months old, and he's already a, a member of the Royal Order of Seraphim. So you guys, uh, Heinz Finch, the current president of Austria, guys. So you guys, the current president of Austria... You guys is a member of the royal order of the seraphim okay um this guy look at all the look at all the honors that this guy is a part of okay guys these are all the chivalry orders that heinz fisher is a part of okay can't make this shit up <laughs> okay um 
to your Heinz Fischer guys. It's president of Austria, okay? Part of the Royal Order of the Seraphim. It's a big control system, guys. You Belgium, um, former king of the Belgians, Albert II. Okay, former queen of the Belgians, uh, Queen Paula. Current king of Belgium, King Philippe. See, you guys, is in the Royal Order of the Seraphim. Uh, in Bulgaria, Pitor Stoinov, president of Bulgaria from 1997 to 2002, is part of this order, Royal Order of the Seraphim. President of Bulgaria from 2002 to 2012, Georgi Paranov, Royal Order of the Seraphim. In Denmark, um, you have the Queen of Denmark since 1972, Queen Marguerite II is part of this chivalry order. Um, you've got Prince uh, Henrik, consort of, Prince, uh, consort of Denmark. Okay, um, you got Crown uh, Prince Frederick of Denmark. Okay, guys. Um, the current president of Estonia, Thomas Hendrik Ives. Okay, guys, is part of the Royal Order of the Seraphim. Okay, can't make this shit up. Okay, you see, you got honorary degrees. This guy has an honorary degree from the John, honorary doctorate from the John Paul II Catholic University. <laughs> okay, you can't make this shit up. Okay, look at the Phoenix. So, uh, Tom Hendrick, guys, the current president of Estonia, guys, is a Jesuit puppet, okay, part of the Royal Order of the Seraphim, and has honorary degrees from Catholic universities. <laughs> okay, um, so uh, the president of Estonia, uh, Thomas Hendrick, in Finland, guys, the president of Finland from 1994 to 2000, Marti Ansistar, uh, president, so guys, the last three uh, presidents of Finland have been a part of this order, okay, can't make this shit up. Tarja Holonen and Sally Ninsto. In France, um, President of France from 1974 to 1981, Varley Gustave Destain. Mark, President of France from 1995 to 2007. And Francis Holland, President of France since 2012. <clears> okay, <throat> hey guys, all Jesuit educated, or all part of this order. Yeah, I've, I, um, the current French President, Emmanuel Marcon. Um, guys, is Jesuit educated, but I'm not. He hasn't been initiated into this particular order yet. So you guys, the King of Greece, Constantine II, the King of Greece from 1964 to 1973, is part of this order. Uh, Prince Philip, Duke of Edinburgh, you okay guys, from uh, the United Kingdom, and King so or Queen Sophia of Spain. Uh, President of Greece from so you guys think that was part of the, the Greek eco economy crashing. President of Greece Carlos Papoulas is a member of the Royal Jesuit Order of the Seraphim. You guys that has IHS right on the logo. <laughs> okay, continuing Iceland. You guys, um, I, I'm gonna botch these names. Vidish Vindersh Vindglader. Okay, guys, President of Iceland. Iceland from 1980 to 1996. Okay, so Royal Order of the Seraphim. Okay, you can't make this shit up. Honorary degrees. Okay. Um, honorary degrees, guys. <laughs> can't make this shit up. Okay, um, so, yeah, so you have three presidents of Iceland. The current president of Iceland, okay, Guani uh, Johansson. Okay, guys, is a royal order of the Seraphim. Okay. Can't make this shit up. It's in his honors right here. Knight Order of the Seraphim 2018. Okay. Um, you see, you can't make the shit up. So the current president of Iceland, you guys. And so the, the fourth, fifth, and sixth presidents of Iceland. Oh, where did I go here? Um, okay, down to Italy. The current president of Italy, Gior Giorgio Napolitano. Okay, no, he was, he was the 11th president of Italy from 2006 to 2015. Okay, so 11th president of Italy was in this order. Okay, in Latvia. Um, you have the president of Latvia from 1993 to 1999, Guntis Umanis, and you have the president of Latvia from 1999, Varia Frigbra. In Luxembourg, you have Grand Duke of Luxembourg, uh, Prince Jean, or Grand Duke Jean. Uh, Grand Duke Henry of Luxembourg is in this order, and Grand Duchess Maria Theresa is in this order. In the Netherlands, Queen Beatrix is in this order, guys. William Alexander, King Alexander of the Netherlands. Okay, and Queen Beatrix, guys. Queen Beatrix is the daughter of, um, what's the guy's name? Um, I, oh, I forgot the guy's name. Qu uh, watch my Bilderberg video. The name's just escaping me right now. Queen Beatrix's father, guys. Oh, C Prince Bernard. That's what it is. Queen Beatrix, guys, is the daughter of Prince Bernard, the Nazi prince, who was one of the co-founders of the Jesuit-created Bilderberg group with Jesuit Joseph Rettinger. 
Okay, but um, yeah, Prince Bernard, guys, is Queen Beatrix's uh, father. Okay, or was. Bernard's dead now, but Bernard is one of the Bilderberg founders. So he's the current king of Netherlands. Um, king of Harald. King Harald V of Norway. Okay, king of Norway. Current king of Norway. Uh, queen of Norway, Sonia. Crown Prince of Norway, Hakatens in this group. Uh, former presidents of Poland, Letz Walcia, president of Poland, 1990 to 1995, is in this order. Uh, the Royal Order of the Seraphim. And the president of Poland from 2010 to 2015, Bronislav Komorowski. Okay, Romania. President of Romania. Okay, guys. Um, let's see. So you had... Okay, guys. Um, he served as president of Romania from 2004 to 2014. Okay. This guy here, guys, is in the Royal Order of the Seraphim. So you can't make this shit up. Of course, guys, he's affiliated with the Communist Party. The Jesuits created communism. Uh, continue, yeah, then see here, guys, Ion Ishtalu. Okay. Uh, President of Romania from 1989 to 1996 and from 2000 till 2004. Okay. And these guys, both these guys are uh, Alishu and Bashu. This isn't the royal order of the seraphim isn't the only chivalry order these guys are part of these all these guys the club is huge guys these roman chivalry orders every country almost has their own or every roman corporation has a chivalry order okay the president of slovakia rudolf schuster okay president of slovakia from 1999 to 2004 you okay, guys are part of this order okay i make this shit up see he's, see all these orders he's part of guys <laughs> Um, continuing, Spain, Juan Carlos, uh, former king of Spain. Okay, guys, um, Sofia, former queen of Spain. Okay, the, uh, former uh, king of Spain, King Fel or he's the current king of Spain, King Felipe the Six. Okay, guys, Felipe the Six was educated at Georgetown too. Uh, president of Turkey. Okay, guys, Amrullah Gul is part of this order. Okay, you see, I think he's the current president. Yeah. Oh, it served as the 11th president of Turkey from 07 to 2004. Okay. Um, Ukraine. Okay, guys, do you think all that Ukraine stuff that was going on with Russia was uh, controlled by Rome? Of course it was. The president of Ukraine at the time, Viktor Yushchenko, from 2005 to 2010, okay, Knight of the Royal Order of Seraphim. And the president of Ukraine from 94 to 2005, Leonid Chukma, Royal Order of the Seraphim. And you got Queen Elizabeth II. Watch my video, guys, on Queen Elizabeth II. She's a part of so many chivalry orders, you can't even count. Uh, King, uh, King Philip, Prince Philip, I mean. Yeah, King Philip. Prince of the United Kingdom, technically, is a prince. Prince Philip, guys, part of this royal order. Prince Charles, part of this royal order. Okay, in Argentina. Got the president of Argentina from 1989 to 1999, Carlos Menhem. Uh, Royal Order of the Seraphim. Okay. Um, let's see if this guy's sources. But yeah, see, of course, guys. Uh, Argentina experienced hyperinflation under this guy. Okay. Um, you see, you guys, honors. Okay, he's also a member of Order of the, the Crown from Malaysia. You can't make the shit up. Okay, so this was former president of Argentina, Menem. Okay, Chile. You guys, Eduardo Free, uh, president of Chile from 1994 to 2000 as part of this order. And the president of Chile from 06 to 2010. Uh, then the, from 06 to 2014, Michelle Bachelet. Okay, it's part of this royal order, the seraphim. Okay, and now, guys, the dates on the left is when these people were initiated into this order. Okay, the president of Mexico from 2000 to 2006, Vincent Fox. You guys, is a member of the royal order of the seraphim. Um, Egypt, guys, Hosni Mubarak, President Mubarak, guys, in Egypt, Egyptian dictator. Okay, guys, royal order of the seraphim. Okay. All these puppets, guys, are controlled by the papacy and the Jesuits. And Ethiopia, guys, Princess of Ethiopia, okay, Sarah and Masasenti, okay, uh, King of Bhutan, Sig okay, can't make this shit up, King of Bhutan, okay, um, Brunei, guys, Hassalani Bokal, you okay, guys, um, the Sultan of Brunei, okay, can't make this shit up. 
Uh, Pengning and Knocked, Queen of Brunei since 1967. Okay, Farha, guys. Uh, Crown Prince of Iran, Reggie uh, Talavi is in this order. Farha, you guys. The Widow of Mohammed Rezu and the former Empress of Iran. Okay. <laughs> Can't make this shit up. In Japan, guys, well, I did a video on Emperor Akito. He's a part of Lake Elizabeth. He's part of the. 50 orders, but here Emperor Akito, guys, is a part of the Royal Order of the Seraphim, and his um, his wife, Michikito, and the Crown Prince of Japan, Naruhito. You guys in Jordan, the Queen of Jordan, Nur, and the guys, King of Jordan, Abdullah II, is also educated at Georgetown, but he's in the Jesuit Royal Order of the Seraphim. Queen of Jordan, Consort, Rhinia, is in this Royal Order of the Seraphim. President of South Korea, Lee Moon Bak, okay. Um, he was president from served as president from 2008 to 2013. Okay, guys, and before that, he was the CEO of Hyundai. <laughs> okay, corporate governance. Okay, uh, Queen of Thailand. Okay, guys, uh, Sir Siri Kits. Okay, guys, King of Thailand. Print and then two princesses of Thailand. Okay, so good, guys. This is just one Vatican chivalry order, guys. And look at this order, though, guys. As the Jesuit, look at this right on the logo, guys. IHS. They're telling you that the Jesuits and the papacy control these orders, okay, guys? All these chivalry orders are controlled by the Jesuits, okay? Yeah, but that's all for this one, YouTube. Um, but you guys, if you, also just quickly, guys, if you want to just, if you type in on YouTube, Royal Order of the Seraphim, I saw there was a bit, you can watch like a 20 minute video of like a ceremony that was done. So check that out. Just, guys, it's important that we need to familiarize ourselves with these orders because these hidden orders are the true, or like, Forces that are pulling the strings behind the scenes. Okay, guys, we see here, guys, the Jesuit Royal Order of the Seraphim with IHS and the Maltese Cross, the three Sesquilevi Papal Trust accounts. I linked all the lists in the show notes. But that's all for this one, YouTube. Peace and love. Namnas.